Humans are the most intelligent animals on earth. At least that's what we think. We are after all smart enough to figure out and do the things that no other animal can do quite like, right? We can think, learn, remember and make decisions. But what if I tell you that animals are like us and can do all that we can do? We know now that insects can recognize faces, dolphins give names to each other, and elephants even mourn their loved ones after their death. But how are animals more intelligent than we think? How do they compare to the human intelligence? Do they have thoughts or beliefs? Are they even aware of themselves? There is an answer, but it is complicated. Before we can move on to answer the question about animal intelligence, we need to define what intelligence is. Intelligence can be defined as the ability to learn, apply knowledge and skills, to understand new or challenging situations, and having the ability to think and solve problems in such situations. Although defining animal intelligence is tricky, measuring it is even more complicated. We know that animals take in information through their senses, processes and make decisions. However, each animal behaves and does this uniquely, making it a challenge to accurately measure their intelligence. The phenomena of animal intelligence has been around for a long time. One particularly famous story is that of the crow and the pitcher, which you may have heard before. The story goes like this. A thirsty crow finds a pitcher with little water that he cannot reach. No matter how many times he tries, he fails. Then an idea comes to his mind. He picks up small stone pebbles and drops them into the pitcher one by one until the water rises to the top, allowing him to finally drink it. There are many stories like this. The history of studying animal intelligence itself is an interesting one. For much of early history, scientists presumed that animal intelligence could be organized into a hierarchy of intelligence, with humans at top, followed by mammals, birds, reptiles, and insects. A little more than 100 years ago, scientists started proving that animals had independent minds like ours. Then in the 1960s, a new generation of researchers began to promote the idea of animal intelligence in a more flexible terms. They suggested that intelligence should be measured in relative rather than absolute terms and abandoned the idea of organizing animal intelligence into a hierarchy. Scientists now understand that animals are capable of demonstrating several cognitive skills and that there are skills that some animals are better at than others. For instance, Reese's monkeys were successfully taught to recognize their own reflection in a test called the mirror test. Besides humans and monkeys, dolphins, chimpanzees, elephants and birds have all demonstrated this ability to recognize themselves in front of a mirror suggesting that self-awareness is a skill that can be taught and may even exist among other animals. Memory is also a big part of animal intelligence. A good many animals are known to possess semantic memory, which is the ability to associate one thing with another, like associating the pain of a bee string with the appearance of a bee. Other animals such as rats and pigeons also possess episodic memory which is the ability to recall past experiences in their mind like remembering successfully navigating through a maze quite a number of animals possess impressive cognitive skills in certain areas they can also learn how to make use of different tools even a tiny insect can learn to work on a task quickly in one experiment bumblebees learned how to push a ball into a hole for a reward Dolphins are particularly famous for having an intelligent mind. In fact, their brain size compared to their body size, also known as encephalization quotient, is so large that it is only second to humans. 
Research suggests that dolphins use whistles to identify and call out each other. In particular, infant dolphins learn their names or individual whistles from their mothers and then keep them for life. Besides this, dolphins can see using a technique called echolocation, where they use sonar and reflected sound waves to get a sense of their surroundings, which in turn help them hunt and even navigate in dark water areas. Among birds, crows are known to make their own tools and plan for the future. In one experiment, scrub jays learned how to hide food in areas where they knew they could find and extract it the next day when they were hungry. Great apes like orangutans can craft umbrellas from plant leaves to protect themselves from rain. So many species in the animal kingdom show intelligence in their own way that it is impossible to cover all of them. It is essential to keep in mind, however, that many tests are narrowed to measure a specific ability. If an animal fails an intelligence test, it does not necessarily mean that the animal is not intelligent. It is possible that the researchers failed to devise an accurate way to measure its intelligence or that the animal can perform other intellectual tasks that we currently do not yet know of. It is like the old saying about judging a fish on its ability to climb a tree. However, certain cognitive skills in some animals have been proven to be even more efficient and quicker than humans. A 2019 study demonstrated the intelligence of an African grey parrot. Researchers presented the parrot with two pairs of empty cups and then placed a nut inside one of each pair while hiding the process from the parrot. Upon lifting one of the empty cups, the parrot correctly identified which of the remaining cups held the reward. This ability to perform tasks even outperformed many five-year-old human children. Similarly, chimpanzees can easily beat humans at a game of recalling a set of numbers when shown on a screen for a fraction of a second, indicating that they also have a better short-term memory than us. But since there is no uniform test for determining intelligence, we cannot simply say that one creature is superior to another. We may be similar, but also different. Perhaps we need to be more considerate in viewing other creatures and their behavior. One day we may even find a way to communicate with other animals, which may tell us how they are not too mindless after all, as we once thought. If you would like to see more of this, be sure to check out our previous videos and remember to subscribe, hit the bell icon to stay notified of the upcoming videos. If you have some future video suggestions, comment down below.